What's up guys, this is Gabe from SP Spin Innovations and we've been working with LC Engineering and doing some testing with the new Magnuson TVS 1320 for the 5BZ engines. This is the same supercharger that just got released not too long ago and is uh, specifically for the uh, Toyota Tacomas, 4Runners, T100s, um, some of the Tundras, kind of basically everything that the 5BZ was uh, put into. LC Engineering did their own install on their very own 2001 Toyota 4Runner. They did this install in their shop, they did a video, uh, installations type of stuff, and they did this more to uh, kind of give some customer support. After they did the install, they took it to a local dyno, and made a few bit passes, and what they found was that the air fuel ratio was dangerously lean. In fact, they were running about 5 pounds of boost and are deep, deep into the 13's air fuel ratio, which is very dangerous to be running 5 pounds of boost at 13 air fuel ratio, 13 anything at that point. It's important to note that all testing was performed at 700 foot elevation with the stock 75 millimeter supercharger pulley, 91 octane pump gas, stock fuel pump, stock but cleaned fuel injectors, stock intake and exhaust system, no modifications at all, no tuning support. We can see that the air fuel ratio is stuck at 14.5 to 14.7 during closed loop control. This is the point where the factory ECU has all the control possible and other external fuel injection management or piggyback systems that use the factory computer as the main source but also alter a separate set of uh, injectors or mass airflow sensor calibration. This is the section here that is uncontrollable. It's uncontrollable because no matter what we do externally, the computer will contradict all changes and maintain the 14.5 to 14.7 air fuel ratio. As we can see here at this point, the factory computer had the original switch point at about 3750 RPMs. We can see here the solid red line, which is our last dyno run. This dyno run or test was performed after installing a 340 liter per hour fuel pump and a 3 to 1 FMU. 3 to 1 FMU is a 3 to 1 fuel pressure regulator rising, which increases 3 pounds of fuel pressure per 1 pound of boost. After looking at it, we can see that the switch point from closed loop to open loop came in a lot earlier, 3500 as opposed to 3750. We're also maintaining a lot more solid air fuel ratio. Air fuel ratio is definitely right around 12 to 1 air fuel ratio, which is a lot safer, a lot more in our target range. 